Hello everyone, welcome back to the Dr. O'Donovan Medicine Made Easy YouTube channel. My name's Dr. James O'Donovan, I'm a medical doctor from the UK and in today's video we're going to be looking at a thyroglossal cyst. Um, this is a midline neck lump which I'm going to be talking about in relation to children. So here's an example of a 12 year old boy and this can be our hypothetical case who's come into your clinic with this midline neck lump that his parents are worried about. Now this is a thyroglossal duct cyst and this is a remnant of the embryonic thyroglossal duct. They're typically found in the midline of the neck and they move up and down upon swallowing and protrusion of the tongue. So here you can see your thyroglossal duct cyst right here and when you ask the child in clinic to put their tongue out, so they're sticking their tongue out here, you can see that the thyroglossal duct cyst has moved upwards and this is a really classic telltale giveaway sign. The majority of thyroglossal cysts are found at the level of the thyrohyoid membrane under the deep cervical fascia and about 65% are located be be below the hyoid bone. Now in terms of presentation, you typically see this painless smooth non-tender lump and the average age at presentation is around 6 years old. Now in terms of diagnosis, it's, it's typically a clinical diagnosis, so you'll be able to tell by seeing the patient or child in clinic. But if you're uncertain, you can do an ultrasound scan, and that can be quite helpful. And here you can see a thyroglossal duct cyst. So in terms of other management, well, it's usually recommended that you see an ENT surgeon. And the management is done through something called a cyst trunk procedure. So I'll just write that out for you here. It's S -I -S -T R U N K. So cyst trunk. And a cyst trunk procedure involves removal of the thyroglossal cyst, the middle third of the hyoid bone, and you follow the thyroglossal tract up to the base of the tongue where it's ligated, and this is to avoid recurrence. So, although most thyroglossal cysts are generally benign and mostly asymptomatic, thyroglossal cysts need to be removed for either cosmetic reasons, to eliminate chance of infection and abscess formation, or to eliminate the development of a carcinoma, which, although it's very rare, it can happen. So I hope you found that useful. So in this video, we've gone over um, looking at what a thyroglossal cyst is and what it originates from. We've had a look at how you can tell it clinically in clinic by looking at the um, lump in the midline of the neck, which usually moves up upon tongue protrusion or swallowing. We've talked about diagnosis. So usually this is a clinical diagnosis, but you can do ultrasound if it's useful or helpful and if you have access to that. And finally, the management of that, that's through a cyst trunk procedure. I um, hope you found that useful. And if you enjoyed the video, please remember to like it comment in the comments section below if you'd like to see anything more and also please remember to subscribe to the channel for more regular weekly uploads. Thanks very much and I hope you enjoyed.